ever go to Whitstable and see the oyster parlours there? My father kept one. I was born in it. What can I That's get my you? sister, Alice. She was a good girl, Alice, and my best friend as well as my big sister. That's my there father. Best Whistable natives you'll ever taste. Right you are, sir. Coming. But this isn't about him. Or Alice. Or my brother Davy. Or my mother. It's about me. Nan Astley. And I was nothing then. I was barely 18. And my life had hardly started. But open an oyster and it's like a secret world in there. And that's how it was with me. I didn't see how my life could have any surprises waiting in it. I suppose I was content with my oyster girl's existence. All right then, Nan. Hello, Freddy. Go for a little walk then. Yes, all right then. I don't mind. That was our little routine. I'd meet him when they brought the boat in, and we'd go for a little walk. And a little spooning. We weren't what you'd call fast. It was expected, really, but I never knew how I was supposed to feel. Tony Reeves was sweet on Alice. He was under manager at the Canterbury Palace of Varieties. Mother thought him a bit rapid, but you could not like him. All right, you bugger. Ding dong, ding dong. <laughs> <laughs> I had that from Gully Sutherland himself. Oh. Hey, you mustn't miss this show next week. It's a stunner. I'll get you in the circle for gallery prices. How's that? It's very kind of you, Mr. Reeves. Tony, Tony. We know each other well enough by now. Well, we should love to come. Is it all right if Nan's Freddy comes along too? Of course. The more He's the merrier. He's not my Freddy, Mother. Oh, he isn't yet, but he'd like to be. Is that about the shape of it? a very special treat for those of you who are connoisseurs of elegance and top class style. Oh, Miss Go Kitty Butler! What do you think? Pretty smart? Not half bad, I should say. I'm following in father's footsteps, following me dear old dad. He's just in front with a fine big gal, so I thought I'd have one as well. There's a rose in my heart for you.
ladies and gentlemen, the one and only Mr. Gully Heel Tickle Your Fancy, Solomon! <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I've had a time of it. I've just been on my own. Awesome. It's at seaside. Just, you want me to come? You're not going to. You're right then. Who's this? Then? I've seen that face somewhere before. Hello? You what? She did? I'm all right now, really. Do you want to go back home? Come on then. Keep me company. Oh, it must be wonderful to work here. It's some of the time it is. You enjoying the show? Oh, yes. Anything in particular? Kitty Butler. I've never, ever seen a girl like her. Oh, you've got an eye for it, young Nancy. She's got it off, hasn't she? Like a proper boy. All the walk, all the business. But then she's not. you got to remember that, Nancy. Well, of course I know that. Well, that's all right, then. <laughs> Oh, I wish I could come and see her every night. Well, there's no reason why you shouldn't. You could put you up in one of the boxes if you like. They're hardly ever taken on a weeknight. Really? Alice. Alice. Mm. How do you feel when you're with Tony? Oh, what a question. Same as you when you're with Freddie, I suppose. I don't feel anything much when I'm with Freddie. Well, perhaps he should be showing him what to do. If you don't like him, chuck him, Nan. Plenty more fish in the sea. It's not I don't like him. Yeah, really. I know. He's just not the one. You'll find someone you really like, then. Promise? You wait. You'll meet someone who'll have your head spinning and your legs turning to jelly <laughs> and you... And what? <laughs> You'll find out. Now shut your eyes and go to sleep. Oh, Rosie. Dear Rosie, there's a rose in my heart for you. But now I come to look around. There's a lot of pretty girls down here as well. <laughs> Put up the lights, Limesman. Let's have a look at you. Well, we're spoilt for choice this evening, gents. Catch. <laughs> Goodbye. Come again. Here she comes in. How is she tonight, Nancy? as good, if not better. <laughs> she's not a real boy, you know. I know she's not. <laughs> you ask me, I think there might be some young chap in the orchestra pit she's got her eye on. <laughs> I just hope young Freddie don't <laughs> catch on. <laughs> I wish you'd all mind your own business. <laughs> <laughs> when I see her, it's like... Oh, I don't know what it's like. When she walks on stage, she makes me want to smile and weep at once. She makes me sore here. I never, ever saw a girl like her before. I never knew that there were girls like her. I don't know what it is. I don't know what's the matter with me, Alice. Do you think I'm cracked? I don't think you should get too keen on that girl, man. Why ever not? They're not like us, people like that. They don't lead natural lives, you know. I think you should forget about her, man. You don't understand, Alice. I don't want to talk about it anymore. It wasn't any use telling me to forget about Kitty Butler. As if I could. And I didn't see why I should. That's it. You hold them as tight as you like. Don't worry. I'll tell you if it hurts. No! I don't want to. What's the matter? Nothing. I just don't want that, Freddy. I'm serious, you know, Nan. We could be engaged. Well, then it would be all right, wouldn't it? Can't we just go on as we are? You don't really care for me at all. I do, though. No, you don't. You just like to keep me there tagging along like... If you really care for me, you'd let me do it. Well, then, I don't care for you. Oh, Nan. No, don't take it like that, Nan. I didn't really mean it. But I did. I meant it. And if what Freddie wanted was only human nature, so was what I wanted. 
But what was it I wanted? I didn't know. But I knew it had something to do with Kitty Butler. He said goodbye with a tear and a sigh And whispered all the pretty things that sweethearts say There's a rose in my heart for you. As a friend would, a locked out door. Sorry, I. No, 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 no. Nothing to be sorry about. You're just the person I wanted. I've got a message for you. Someone wants to see you. Who? 